now the big one we've all been waiting for. OK Computer by Radiohead. Oh boy, Zach. Oh boy, how do we feel about this guy? Fuck. Yeah. I mean, fuck. I mean, where do you, how do you even talk about OK Computer by Radiohead? Here's when Radiohead stopped being a rock band and started being artists, man. You know what I mean? It's like, we don't want to fucking just write tunes anymore. You know, they put out the first single for the record. They refused to do a radio edit of it. It's the seven minute paranoid android. It's like fucking bohemian rhapsody for like pretentious people. Oh, you know what God. I mean? Yeah. It's just like, fuck, but it's just like tasty licks. Mm. Tom's singing about how the world's fucked. He's all politically engaged. He's having a terrible time. Yeah. But this whole record, they went out to like a chateau in like France and just like rented this fucking place out. They got this guy, Nigel, who'd like engineered one song on the record before it to produce it. Turns out to be Nigel Godrich, who would be like the greatest producer of all time. Maybe mm. one of them. This is the first record he ever produced. Listen to this fucking record and try and get your head around it. The textures, mm. man. Mm. It's crazy. So I don't know what it is about French chateaus as well. You oh. know, like Exile on Main Street and stuff. This is like proper chateau music, man. Yeah, man. All class. Get up on YouTube, look up them playing Paranoid Android on Jules Holland. Oh, yeah. Oh. God. Fuck. What's amazing about every song on this record, basically, it just has this enormous like arc to it every mm. song just builds like so steadily and so perfectly and all the elements interlock together in such perfect pacing and just every climax is just so big it's like pink floyd it's just like so Whoa. satisfying yeah this record i can't even think of where you would be funny about it because it's just I'm deadly serious it's about just a, this record. It's a is. big record, man. And I think for any teenager, like a, a big, you know, turning point of just like what you can make with music, man, and what you can do. And, you know, and this, this record broke that band. You know, they were, they were finished after this. They didn't know what the fuck to do with themselves because they didn't even know how to match it. Mm. And how they followed it, I mean, I, you know, mm. it's about one of the greatest one-two punches ever in the history of anything do you know mm -hmm. what i mean this is like napoleon this is like hot shots one then straight into hot shots two yeah part deux part deux yeah part do you know what I mean? what? this is yeah. like godfather straight into what was the sequel to godfather called uh the mafioso's wife yeah that's it see i'm, I'm a sound boy more than a lyric boy and i'm Zach's just always been a bit of a sound boy. and i just i'm just bathing myself in hot sounds i mm. love even as i get older and i've kind of gone off a lot of guitar music i mean this is an album that i can just listen to hundreds of times it's absolutely faultless i mean this is just one of the most obvious five tom records in the history of records it, mm. it, it's 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 got to be it's got to be five mm. yeah this is a real underground classic and you're going to be really glad that we recommended it to you and helped you discover this mm. record okay computer by radiohead this is probably the best record of all time five toms